Secure Connectivity Partnership announced by SpaceX and Google Cloud. Google Cloud and SpaceX have announced a new secure connectivity partnership to deliver data, cloud services, and applications to customers at the network edge. Leveraging Starlink's ability to provide high-speed broadband internet around the world and Google Cloud's infrastructure. Under this partnership, SpaceX will begin to locate Starlink ground stations within Google Data Center properties, enabling the secure, low latency, and reliable delivery of data from more than 1,500 Starlink satellites launched to orbit to date to locations at the network edge via Google Cloud. Google Cloud's high-capacity private network will support the delivery of Starlink's global satellite internet service, bringing businesses and consumers seamless connectivity to the cloud and internet, and enabling the delivery of critical enterprise applications to virtually any location. Organizations with broad footprints, like public sector agencies, businesses with presences at the network edge, or those operating in rural or remote areas often require access to applications running in the cloud, or to cloud services like analytics, artificial intelligence, or machine learning. Connectivity from Starlink's constellation of low Earth orbit satellites provides a path for these organizations to deliver data and applications to teams distributed across countries and continents quickly and securely. Combining Starlink's high-speed, low-latency broadband with Google's infrastructure and capabilities provides global organizations with the secure and fast connection that modern organizations expect, said SpaceX President and Chief Operating Officer Gwynne Shotwell. We are proud to work with Google to deliver this access to businesses, public sector organizations, and many other groups operating around the world, she said. This new capability, delivered by Google Cloud and Starlink to enterprise customers under the Secure Connectivity Partnership, is expected to be available in the second half of 2021.